And here I am. That's Beaver Street along the Belmont Waltham border. And these this double track thing is the Fitchburg line for commuter rail. And this thing that's veering away is the Central Massachusetts Railroad line. aiming to become the Massachusetts Central Rail Trail. And I've been meaning to get to it for a little while. This is an interesting project where significant trail work has already been done over in the middle of the state in Northampton. And now the Boston side of the state is poised to pick up the task. The funny little light to nothing. <laughs> since been abandoned. It looks kind of new. And this understory stuff growing in this nuked to smithereens little strip kind of looks like salicornia that you find in salt marshes. Maybe there's a fat enough accumulation of brine in the soil that the salicornia finds a foothold. Already, you can see the tracks are kind of buried, and it's really overgrown. <laughs> it's once again a, a bit of a bout of urban bushwhacking. Another intrepid adventure I've gotten myself into. Doesn't look like people pass through this thing very often. spotted an old railroad junk pile back over there earlier. Yep, this is some serious bushwhacking. Thorny stuff and everything. But as the intrepid rail trail doofus that I am, I will not be deterred. Even if I am deterred. Something. A skulking deer, maybe? No. The usual a 
abundance of poison ivy. Bindweed and similar things can be found. It wouldn't take much to make a base of trail here already, really just trim some of the really overgrown sections. Ooh, a cool little bridge over an effluent of inflicted stream. Yeah, look at the turbidity. A lot of laundry slop or something. Right, so we found our first interesting little rail relic. A tiny stream bridge. Usually when you get into sections that have some forest going on. They become more navigable. It's that transition phase that's really the handful. Got a nice breeze. It's kind of a redo of summer today. Aiming to go up to the 80s. Indian summer maybe? Maybe that's later. And look at this little birch maze that awaits me. Plenty of birds. Birds probably love these things that's reasonably safe. Oh, look at all the blackbirds. <laughs> it's so overgrown, you have to periodically <laughs> stop and stare below to see if you're really within the railroad track. following for a bit. Probably a formal drain swale element. One of the things I noticed, oh yeah, here's another cool little bridge. A little bit more substantive than the prior one. Passing through probably the same Eutrophic laundry slop stream. Yeah, the going has certainly improved a little. First kind of possible local vernacular trail. Something like it. Maybe it's a deer way. And we're still running 
in kind of a parallel to the Fitchburg line. Up, the shack. Look at it. Doesn't seem to be current. Jeez. So this is where you go to meet the juncture of this abandoned line with the Fitchburg active line. And this will eventually take you all the way to Northampton. Oh look, strange rail graffiti. Yeah, at least here we've got lots of jewel weed. <sighs> There's a nice block. 